Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Weasel, and it is super warm. It is really hot today. I'm sweating profusely. And you know what else is hot? Yes, the nuke that dropped in 60 seconds. Talking about bad segues, let's go start a new game. Actually, on the survival mode. Uh, we're gonna try the survival mode this time. Uh, again, in the Fatman normal difficulty. The game will give me randomly selected supplies. So I am not going to scavenge for 60 seconds. Despite the name. We're just going to go with what the game gives us. This is going to be our challenge on normal. I have no idea what we can expect. I hope the whole family. Uh, that'd be nice. Well, never mind. Dolores isn't here. Well, well, at least I got the kids. That's something. Which is a shame, so we got to be really careful about Ted. Anyway, the three of us are safe and sound. We just to make it work from now. We really wish it was four of us. Oh, that's so sad. The cans, uh, the shelves are full of cans. We leave from cans. We sleep on cans, plenty of water, and best stock shelter. How much do we have? Four cans of soup, six bottles of water. That's actually a good ratio. Um, we have a med kit, we have a gas mask, flashlight, map. Do we have playing cards? Yeah. Hey, this is actually, with the radio and the rifle, it's actually kind of nice. I like it. I like it. Sorry, sorry, Dolores. But hey, it's something. Let's just uh, keep the kids alive to keep the sanity high, and let's see if the military is gonna come and save us. Single dad, I'm pretty sure you're gonna find a wonderful female survivor that is totally into that single dad thing. Anyway, where was I? Ah, yes, everything's going fine, nothing to worry about. Uh, I think I'm gonna prepare an expedition with Timmy, and... Something is watching you. Our shelter is tiny, but that this has been bugging us for a while now. We checked all the closets and no one's hiding there. Is there something alive down there besides us? Maybe a rodent of some kind? If so, we need to show it that we're the dominant species. Um, is that the crocodile thing again? If yes, I'm happy that we have the rifle. And it didn't break. Very good. Very good. Whatever it was, it's dead now. Quite dead. Well, wouldn't, wouldn't you tell me what it is? Let's hope there's nothing hiding anymore. That would be nice. All right, we're gonna send Teme. Teme, make daddy proud. And your, and, your, and your big sister. It's time to grow up. Show you that you can be a real man. That brings us good loot. Then we went to the wasteland. Yes, yes, no, no water. Oh, well, I just decided to skip past that event. And we're really tired now. Why, I wonder? There's nothing here. Maybe if we try really hard, we can hear the neighbors in their shelter. Um, both are really tired. I wonder why. If I didn't accidentally skip over the last message, I would probably know. Anyway, water for you two. I hope Timmy's fine. We're pretty sure Mary Jane had a birthday two weeks ago. Well, let's give her some playing cards. Two weeks ago! Man, you're horrible parents. If you pray and forgot a birthday. Two weeks ago before the whole nuclear thing happened. Anyway, she loves cards, so she's happy. No, no trouble, nobody's complaining. And we smell bad, but there's nothing we can do about that. Ah, no gas mask, no bug spray, and no ammunition. Wow, hey! That is great. That is fantastic. We both got infected with something. Well, Ted, uh, we gotta keep you alive. That's important. That's the important part here. And he's hungry. Sorry, Mary Jane. Only one, not two. I'm surprised that there's not more medicine in there. Maybe Timmy's gonna bring back something for his big sister. That would be really nice. Ted wants water. Mary Jane is hungry. I don't know if I should give you something. Oh, we're going out again into the darkness. Well, let's use the flashlight and see if we can scare it off. Whatever we're encountering. Never use the flashlight. Usually always use the rifle. So what, what does it tell us? Uh, guess what? It was a dog. The poor thing seemed tired, so we let it stay with us for the night. It's pancake! Yay! I forgot! Oh! All this time that I always seen this, like, event, I could just use the flashlight and we see the dog. Well, now I know how to get pancake on a regular basis. Ha! Pretty sure someone told me in the comments. Eh, anyway. Mary Jane keeps fainting. She needs something to drink, drink, drink. Yeah, doggy's gonna come back. Uh... Should we tinker with the radio? We sure know starting staring at it won't help. I'll try it. I'll risk it. Why not? Let's see if we can tinker with it. Nope, you didn't break it, so that's great. Okay, Timmy's back. Didn't bring medicine. Well, well, we did what we could, but we still can't hear a thing. Damn it. 
Good. The new gasoline reserves under the nearby gas stations. Okay, one bottle of water and bug spray. Mm, ah, we don't have a Boy Scout book. We can't do anything. Ah, well. It's time for water. Interesting. Timmy should need water at this point, but... No need for that. That's fine. Trash can is becoming full of empty soup cans, and that's unmentionable bucket is overflowing. You know what? Let's use the box spray to deal with the stench before everyone gets sick. We have to set priorities here, and that means... Well, we dodged a bullet this time. That is if a bullet was a huge hairy head. Eight legs. Oh, right. Right. The bugs. <sighs> if we don't cure Mary Jane soon, we know who knows what happens. Well, nothing. She's probably gonna die. Let's... let's... Let's be honest about that. Oh, Timmy wants water now. Interesting. So his his schedule is off. Wait, who wanted food? Timmy. Just Timmy. Good. Here you go, Timmy. Very well deserved. Okay. Let's see if we can listen into the radio for the military. I'd love to see that. Day 12. Mary Jane is still alive. However, she managed to pull that one off. We made contact with military, militaries out there, and they're coming for us. Mary Jane is rested. Should eat. All right, here's some food, even though I'm not happy that I have to give you so much food. Um, Mary, J Mary Jane is more than ready to go out and scavenge. Well, if she survives. Um, something has been making a lot of noise and storm. We couldn't sleep. It seems to be coming from under the floor. We just found the manhole that we could get down and check what's going on. Nope, we're not checking out the manhole. I hope we're not going down there. Okay, seems like we're not. Because there's a crocodile. Yeah, it's not a good idea. They're giving us the creeps even up here. Oh, we might go crazy by not going down. Well, we'll see. Uh, getting something to drink from Mary Jane sounds like a good idea. And food. Okay, I'm gonna give him food and her food and water because I'm sending her out. And I wanna give her, like, at least a fighting chance to come back. Otherwise, what was the point of having her around in the first place? Right? So. Uh, he's not looking well. We can do water tomorrow. Barking on the doorstep! Could only mean one thing, our dog friend is back! Yay! Give him, give him some food. Now he's gonna stay with us and gonna hopefully bring us more food and water to stay alive. Good times, good times. Dog was back to his former self in under an hour. We don't know what they put in that soup, but man, that stuff is good! Yes, it's Pancake! Who's a good boy? Okay, of course I need water. Uh, we lost some soup, but I'm pretty sure Pancake is gonna bring something back. Yeah, let's listen to the radio. We should do that. And now we got Pancake. Who is going to come back eventually and stay with us? Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. Or we're not seeing him for whatever reason. I think he's not here yet. Great news, the fallout outside is mostly gone. Should be much safer to travel to the surface now. Good to know. Good, good for Mary Jane outside. Uh, I can't do anything about that dancing cockroach. Let's hope it leaves us alone. Well, there's one. A mutant cockroach. Oh my, that thing is huge. And there goes another one. Ugh, Timmy's hungry. Timmy, you're hungry. I can't help you with that. I have soup. We planned... Oh, we got a waterfall. Great. So we can pick one of those three things. I think it's going to be the radio. And the flood is going to destroy everything. Thank you, game. Thank you so much for that flood that you brought upon us. <sighs> well, two more days, then you get some water. The military is transmitting again. Their first step is to locate remaining survivors. Let's use the flashlight. Let's use the flashlight to indicate... Ooh, Mary Jane is back, and she's still alive, and she brought a med kit. Guess what, Mary Jane? You're gonna stay alive. And she brought two soup cans, thanks to that friendly monkey. While we explored one of the streets, our monkey companion ran away, only to come back moments later carrying a can of food. Yay! At one point during the expedition, the monkey started making weird sounds, digging in front of us with a stick. A few bottles of water, one at least. And the monkey took us outside to the town to see what seemed like a hidden bunker. Contained some medical supplies. Well, yeah, she needs food. Uh, Ted is also hungry. Wait, Timmy needs food, right? No, Mary Jane needs food. There you go, and I'm gonna give her the med kit. Exciting, exciting. Everyone's still alive. Um, it seems that our little green pest guests are trying to communicate with us. One was even holding something that resembled a sign which read, We camp and peace. What on earth do they mean? Well, let's not kill them then, if they're coming in peace, so... 
totally down with that. Oh, fantastic. Maybe we went crazy because of that. This is insane. Why would we talk to roaches? Are we going insane? Are we? Yes, we are. Mary Jane is quite hungry. And she went nuts. And she wants water. Of course, water and food for her. And water for everyone else. Here. Man, crazy is not good. They're probably going to break the radio or something. It's Pancake, our friend, but he seemed nervous, keep barking and jumping. When we opened the door, he rushed out only to come back moments later and bark at us again. Maybe we should follow him. Let's follow him with a rifle, just to be on the safe side. I hope we can help him. I forgot what this is an item that we should bring. Oh no, we got injured. What happened? The old saying goes, better safe than sorry. The rifle seemed to be the right choice of gear for venturing into the unknown. We didn't expect to run into trigger-happy folk who started shooting before asking questions. Gunshots were enough to send Pancake running. We got back safely, but he didn't show up. Aww. Better safe than sorry might not be the best choice of words if you got shot, and that's what happened. They had a good aim. And Ted got hurt. Well, that's a shame. Alright, let's give Mary Jane some soup. That's a shame. That's a big shame. I hope my kids are gonna go better. Gonna be better. I like the different states that they have. Mary Jane is tired and crazy. Therefore she, and hungry, but you don't usually see hungry. But I like that she's tired and crazy. So she like really has a hard time staying awake being a chicken. Mary Jane's diet could use food. Also something for her nerves like antidepressants. Timmy has rested. Ted mentals health worries is all, but we don't know how to help him. Maybe we can send Timmy out. Oh yeah, we can. All right, let's listen to the radio. Tune in into the military broadcast, hopefully. Well, it's an interesting development. Wait, how, how, why did that change from the left arm to the right arm? Did you get hurt again, or did it just look different? Once we had waited through the static, we found a transmission that was hosted by some not talking about conspiracies and saw some men from Mars abducting people. It was pretty amusing. Oh, okay. Mary Jane is no longer crazy. Entertainment helped us in this case. Okay, uh, Timmy should eat something. Yeah, we're gonna give Timmy water and food. And Ted, yeah, it's fine. Also no longer crazy. Good, 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 good stuff. Very good stuff. All right, day 24. They're just tired, so we can deal with this. Not happy about Ted being sick. Really not happy about that. Maybe he's bringing something back. We learned a valuable lesson recently. If you don't do anything about roaches, you will end up with more roaches. That's not ideal if we don't do anything. Well, all right, let's shoot them. Let's shoot the roaches. What could possibly go wrong? Well, nothing apparently. Victory is ours. The roaches lie defeated. Oh, this is a glorious day for all remaining humanity. Humans are the dominant species once again. Well, maybe in this bunker. Mary Jane keeps fainting. We need to find something to drink. Mary Jane is pretty fatigued. Yes, yes, yes. And hungry. He's hungry. And you guys get both water because it's day 25. Another radio broadcast. Oh, they want us to throw out the rifle. Sure. Why not? Now we're defenseless. You better make it worth it, game. You better make it worth it. You better make it worth it. Okay. Anything troubling? Nope. Nobody's troubling. Uh, nothing, no event. Let's hope Timmy comes back and brings a rifle. That would be great. I wonder how they would know if we threw the rifle out or not. Just saying. Ted's wounds are not a pretty sight. Uh, yeah, I know. I wish I could do something about that, Ted. Sorry. Let's hope he doesn't get sick or infected. Oh, no med kit. And Timmy is sick. Well... That's bad. That's bad. Two bottles of water, playing cards, and Mary Jane is hungry. And thirsty, that is. Timmy should eat. Ted should drink something. And he got Ted got sick. He is already sick. Wait, no, he was just injured. Oh well. Oh well. Okay, who wants food? I forgot. Timmy and Mary Jane. Well then. Mary Jane is feeling excellent. Well then, Mary Jane, bring us a med kit. Timmy has been talking about going out to the surface to explore, run and play with whatever burnt remains can be found. We would gladly jump at any chance to get in some fresh air, though we are worried to exposure to radioactivity. That's fine, let Timmy out. Let 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 that boy play. Give him, you know, can, he can play some soccer. Although he might not be back. Well, Timmy should be returned by now. We need to face the worst possible scenario. He might not come back. 
Well, there was a chance. Ah, well. Interesting. It says, like, he should have returned by now, but after that, we're talking about how he left the bunker. Interesting. Mary Jane keeps fainting. Ted got one foot in the grave. You don't need anything. You guys are fine. Mary Jane can go outside. Let's just hope that Ted can survive for a few days until Mary Jane comes back and brings him the much need. Oh, I should give him some water. Well, Ted, I don't feel confident at all with your chances to survive. We've been wondering about that other door on the shelter. Should it even be here? Yes, let's check out the other door. Usually there's nothing back there, but I'm willing to risk it. Let's see. Every corner, there was nothing. Waste of our time. And he still hasn't recovered from his sickness. Where did that green puddle come from? Oh dear, a pipe is leaking green goo. That's not good, not good at all. We need to act now and no one packed him up. What do we do? Well, we drown in green puddle stuff. I mean, Ted is already sick, so what's the worst that could happen to him? Ted is fine, actually. We couldn't figure out. So we just assumed that's regular pipe. would do in an event of a nuclear apocalypse and decided to ignore it. We've been feeling a bit funny today, though. Probably no connection to the pipe, none whatsoever. Okay, good. Man, it's such a shame that Pancake ran away. Ooh, and she's back. And she did not bring a mad kid. What did you bring? Did you bring a... Mm, and a bar fittingly called the world's end. Usually such a respectable family like our own would never go there, but this time we gave it a shot. We got a board of checkers. That is all you got. Well, and I can't send anyone out to the military right now to tell them about our position because nobody's ready to get out. Ah, oh, Mary Jane. No med kid, really. Mary Jane. Okay, she needs water. They, they both need water tomorrow. We're about to finish dinner when we heard someone knocking on the door. It seems to be a trader who's interested in ammunition. Well, I don't have ammunition, and I'm not gonna give away my board of ch checkers, or my checker board, whatever you want to call it. Kinda need that. Uh, I'm so worried about Ted. Ted looks like he got one foot in the grave, he needs water, yes. And she needs food. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna try it. Water for both, and just food for Mary Jane, so I could maybe send her out tomorrow if she's feeling better. That's just my, o my only hope that I have. My only hope. Being stuck in such a tiny shelter would make anyone a bit empathetic. Uh, she could use some food. Ted is still sick. There's nothing I can do with the rations. I'm gonna prepare an expedition for tomorrow. Just in case. But, yeah, unless the military comes, I think we are in trouble. Okay, Ted is hungry. Yeah, I bet he is. And I can't send anyone. Damn it! The end. Ted starved, the daughter went crazy. Well, what an end to the survival mode. So the survival mode isn't really much easier, just with the difference that I don't need to run around and scavenge stuff. That's something, I guess. What a shame. Timmy did not make it back. Secrets of the shelter, plumbing action, visit the bar, not in the army now. Well, 38 days. Not too shabby, not too shabby. But not good enough to survive, or get rescued, actually. Uh, because I guess eventually you are going to die. Anyway, we perished. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like. Hit that like button. Again, thanks so much for everyone who keeps following, who keeps subscribing, who and everyone who keeps watching this series. I'm glad you enjoyed. I know it's been going on for so long, and I still haven't won. I am trying my best here. I am really trying and I'm reading your comments, so if you have any more ideas, let me know in the comment section below. I'm Weasel, I'm out, and I hope to see you around. Bye-bye.